Hi guys, it's Kim. Welcome back to my channel. I am here with another Fantastic Ladies collab. This is an update for the Pan of Green Gables Project Pan. This was created by Anna and I will have all the information for the project listed down below. If you'd like to hear how I did this month, then stay tuned. <laughs> She thinks everybody wants to hear her. <coughs> Rosie, no. Well, I'm going to get on with the update. So um, for this project, there were one, two, three, four, five, six, there were eight prompts and I've already made goal on two of them. So let me get on with the update for the next, um, for the rest of the pro products. Rosie, you've got me all twisted here. So for the prompt, here is red as carrots. I chose to use this um, Sexy Mama Anti-Shine Translucent Powder from the balm because there is red on here. Hair is red as carrots. Carrots are orange though. But anyway, um, that means your hair is orange. Anyway, um, this is an okay powder. It definitely is not translucent though. It does make my foundation concealer whatever look maybe like a quarter of a shade darker, but it's okay and I'll use it. My goal is to use it eight times and so far I've used it five. It does have these weird little bumpies in it. I don't know why. Um, the powder still performs and I've heard other people have had the same problem. So I don't know, it's not bad. So I'm going to just keep using it. Um, if anybody can tell me why those bumpies are there, let me know. It, they were there from like minute one. So it's not because it's older. For the next prompt, the Lake of Shining Waters, something shiny, I chose this Charlotte Tilbury contour wand. My goal was to use it eight times and I did. So this is gonna roll out. Here is a swatch of it there. It is so pretty and it just blends out beautifully. So it's great for a contour or a bronzer. Um, so yeah, so that's gonna roll out, but I'm excited to keep using it and keep it in my collection. For the prompt, broken slate, something broken or damaged. For that, I chose this um, unique pigment in the shade Com uh, Confident. This was um, cracked and damaged. I had to press it back into this. It was also a loose mineral pigment when I first got it and I pressed it into the pan and then it broke again and I had to fix it up. So here it is. And my goal is to use it eight times. So far I've used it three and here is a swatch of it right there. It's super pretty. I like it, but I didn't make goal on it. So it's going to stay in. For the prompt, puffed sleeves, something bulky or excessive. For that I chose this at the beach um, body spray from Bath and Body Works. And I basically use it to um, zhuzh up my curtains and my linens and stuff like that. I don't use it as a body spray. And this is the progress I made from that second line to that third line. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna keep using it. This will probably be in for a couple of more months. Let's see, judging on my progress, one, two, three, four, five. I'll, I'll probably be until the end of the project in October, but that's okay. Um, for Matthew Cuthbert, something sweet. I chose this fresh balm um, and I don't want to roll it up because it's wicked tilted and it's getting all crum crumbly in there, but I was able to um, make a mark on the tube there. So it went from that top line to that bottom line and I have until here to go. So I don't think it'll be gone next month, but in the next two, it should be done. Um, my goal is to finish it. So I'm gonna keep using that. And then last but not least um, for Marilla Cuthbert, hard exterior, soft interior, cream or liquid product with hard packaging. For that, I chose my um, Charlotte Tilbury Lip Cheat 
liner in the shade Pillow Talk. My goal is to use it 10 times and I have been able to use it seven times. It went from 6.9 centimeters to six centimeters, so it is going down. And here is a swatch of it right there. It's super pretty, I really like it. Um, so yeah, so that's gonna stay in the project as well. So there you go. If you like this update, please give it a thumbs up. And if you liked me, please consider subscribing. I hope you have a great day or night wherever you are and I will talk to you soon. Bye.